So if you're into sheet music, which if you've been following my channel and my stuff for any period of time, you know I'm not a big fan of sheet music. I like learning songs a much, much better way. So I'm not gonna need that. Hey everyone, Jacques Hopkins here, creator of PianoIn21Days.com. And one of the most common questions I get is, hey Jacques, I'm ready to start your lessons, but I don't have a piano or keyboard yet. For those people, I've always pointed them at my piano and keyboard buying guide, which I'll link below this video. And that buying guide gives you several options depending on your needs and your budget. But in this video, I want to show you without a doubt, hands down, the very best bang for your buck digital piano slash keyboard that you can buy if you're on a budget and you're ready to get started right away. This keyboard that I'm about to show you is about 200 US dollars and it has some amazing features. It's by a brand called Alesis, which I've recommended for years. I bought my first Alesis keyboard about 15 years ago. It was the QS 8.2 and it has lasted a very, very long time, but I'm really excited to show you. I just got this in the mail. It's the Alesis Recital Beginner keyboard. Full size, 88 keys. They're semi-weighted keys. And I'm gonna go ahead and unbox this guy and show it to you. All right, so inside the box, obviously we have the keyboard itself. And guys, it's super, super light. I like the portability of this guy. The old Elisa's keyboard I had weighed probably a hundred pounds and I would take it and go play it at various places and it was hard to transport. So if you're looking for something easy to transport, this thing is super, super light, but it's still a full-size keyboard, 88 keys. And one of the reasons that it's so light is it's got semi-weighted keys. Now, if you're a beginner, if you're a beginner to learning piano or keyboard, semi-weighted keys is going to be plenty good enough because it's got a, a similar feel to fully weighted keys. You know, when you press, it's got some, it's got some give to it. It's not completely flimsy. It's semi-weighted. It's probably 70 to 80% as good as fully weighted keys, but you're paying far, far less for this. So let me take this paper out. So we have the keyboard. It also comes with, this is just gonna be the power, the power cords. So let's go ahead and get this plugged in. All right, let's see what else comes in the package. We have some papers. This is just a, a get started guide. Won't need much with that. And I believe this is going to be a little music stand. So if you're into sheet music, which if you've been following my channel and my stuff for any period of time, you know I'm not a big fan of sheet music. I like learning songs a much, much better way. So I'm not gonna need that. That's all that's included in the basic package. We have the keyboard itself, we have the power cord, we have that music stand. Now, I'm going to link below to my Amazon affiliate link, and if you get anything out of this video at all, I'd appreciate you using that link to go ahead and make your purchase if you're gonna purchase this keyboard anyway, but I'll also include a link to the Alesis Recital keyboard kit. That kit is going to include a bench, it's going to include a sustain pedal, which is important, and it's going to include a stand. So if you don't have those things already, you may wanna go ahead and check out that full kit, which you can get for less than $300. So I have a sustain pedal already. I'm gonna go ahead and plug in my sustain pedal to this keyboard. All right, guys, my sustain pedal is plugged in, the power cord is plugged in. Now I'm just gonna go ahead and turn it on. Turn up the volume. So the feel is good. It's good. It's not great. And if you're at a beginner in the piano learning process, I highly recommend you do not go out and spend hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of dollars on a new piano or a new keyboard. I recommend you get something budget friendly until you know you're going to stick with it. And what I always tell people is once you actually learn how to play piano, 
then you can reward yourself with something big and fancy if you want that baby grand piano for your living room or some special room in your house. Learn piano first on something like this and then reward yourself once you actually know how to play. And of course, if you want the fastest and most fun way to learn how to play piano, then of course there's Piano in 21 Days. And right now I've got a free five day workbook waiting for you. I'm gonna to link to that below this video. That's gonna help you learn 36 popular songs on the piano in just five days, even if you've never even touched a piano before. So if you're brand new at this and you don't even have a keyboard yet, go down below, go ahead and buy this Alesis recital and then grab a copy of that five day workbook for free and get started. And you're going to be playing songs, actual songs, not songs written 400 years ago, but popular songs on your new keyboard in just five days. And guys, this thing just couldn't be any simpler. I'm all about simplicity and you can see how few buttons there are on here, how few options there are on here. I was able to just plug it in power it on and I'm starting to play my new keyboard. So guys, if you think the Alesis recital is for you, and I promise you this is the best bang for your buck beginner keyboard out there. If you think this is for you, go ahead and scroll down. I've got a link below waiting for you to buy it on Amazon. And of course, once you get your new keyboard, you need some lessons and head over to piano in 21 days.com and grab a copy of that. Learn 36 pop songs in just five days. Good luck with your new keyboard. And I look forward to being your piano teacher.